don't like that? Yeah, I'm the other way. All right. Finally got the fender off. It's quite a job. Looks like a mess right now. But uh, when I uh, put the new fender on, I'll video that. I'm gonna clean up the inside there and get things kind of cleaned up to where it looks kind of decent inside that uh, that wheel well there on the top. There's a lot of weeds and dirt and stuff in there. So I'm gonna vacuum that all out, clean it all up, and then uh, I'm gonna put the fender back on, and uh, we'll see how the truck looks with the new fender on. Pick up and uh, put a new fender on it. Let me show you that. And now I'm uh, doing body work because I'm gonna I'm getting ready to get it painted. And I'm gonna have it painted by a shop, but I'm uh, getting rid of some of the dents on the truck and because uh, I want to paint it black and so I want to try and get as many of the little, little beans that I can out of it so that they don't show up because black shows everything but uh, since the fender on it kind of inspired us to paint it black so anyway that's uh, that's what it looks like uh, some of the uh, work that I've been doing to get these dents out and uh, yeah this is the 1989 Ford we've been working on for a couple months now we've done a lot of work to it and uh, we just got out of the shop the uh, paint shop today and I did a bunch of uh, body work on it myself and yeah you can see some flaws but all in all I think it came out pretty good is all blacked out Let's take a look inside this engine compartment 7.3 liter diesel and it did have a lot of grease on it clean it up and get the grease off of it make it look a little better in there. Done a lot of maintenance, change the oil, air filter, master cylinder, uh, done a lot of things to fix the truck up. Uh, I'll do a cold start on it right now and let you guys hear it. 